We walk with our people because that's what we're charged to do as politicians. We don't become separate from our communities because we get elected to this House of Assembly. We listen to what people have to say. We work with them to find solutions. And we work go beyond the community when the capacity is not in the community to do what needs to be done. We source it in other places and we bring it home to work with our community partners to rebuild, to grow, to reinvest. And Mr. Speaker, while we're doing that, we see the difference that that kind of approach has made in the lives of the people of Newfoundland and Labrador. Our initiatives in education, what that has meant for young people and ex access to post-secondary education. What a joy it was, Mr. Speaker, to be a member of this government when for the very first time five years ago, we went over a billion dollars investment in our budget in education in one year. Mr. Speaker, that is absolutely marvelous. Mr. Speaker, I came from a generation that had to get over apologizing for who we were and what we sounded like. And I marvel at our young people here today. Mr. Speaker, I was here in this House of Assembly this morning with 91 young elementary school children. They're bright, they're smart, they're healthy, they're beautiful, they're full of energy, they're full of hope. Mr. Speaker, it lifts you up. If you ever needed a reminder of what we're doing in this place, then all you had to do was come here this morning and look at those beautiful young faces and know, and know that the world is available to them. And why is it? Because they'll be properly trained, educated, supported in our communities here in this place. They'll be fed and looked after by their parents because they have the means to do it. Because they will either be able to do it because of the good work that's available in this province and the good wages that are available to the people in this province from all the different uh, uh, businesses that we have on the go, all the different resources that we have being developed here in this province, or because of the social programs that we have to support families who are going through a rough patch. We're doing our very best to make sure that nobody gets left behind, that we're an inclusive society, and that everybody in this place matters to us. Here, here. Here.